scorched heat. It happened one late October night. Steve and Eric's little boy's trick turned out in a fire, which killed their hated school teacher, Mr. Anderson. But 20 years later, one of them had strange visions. How could you do such a thing? Steve, who had moved to Dallas, could only draw one conclusion when he got the message from his old friend. I must have gone crazy somewhere, you know? Understand? If you're trying to scare me, you better stop it right now, because we ain't staying here. One more... Well, hello, I'm Peter Borg, and uh, I was the director for the film Scorched Heat, and uh, one of the true uh, thrills in making this film uh, was working with this uh, Harold Treutiger. I know, uh, he, he, he really has been one of the one of the most successful TV hosts uh, in uh, Scandinavia. Uh, and uh, to, to kind of, I would really say, discover him as an actor uh, was an ultimate experience. And uh, he was really very talented at that time already. And uh, to work with him and see him act in, in uh, uh, such a thrilling piece of film that this is, uh, was absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> That's crazy, it's you! He's back. Not only was he back from the grave, he was back with the power of creating horrible illusions. Uh, there's always a, a big challenge in uh, uh, combining uh, two elements like horror and comedy, as uh, we did in Scorched Heat. Uh, I must say, though, uh, now, uh, so many years later, uh, knowing what a what a phenomena of cult cinema this this has become, we really succeeded in in, in getting this mix blend uh, right uh, to create this feeling of your one time, one moment you just laugh and just bam like that you're in <gasps> you're in the horror state and. To see that wave go through the film uh, is a challenge, but I, I really say we did it. We succeed. Oh, Steve, uh, Nike Tyler's from the Bone Breakers called, and he's really pissed at you. Uh, I don't know what he was pissed about because I couldn't understand him. You know how he talks that jive when he gets angry. What kind of bullshit is this? Sorry, what do you mean? Well, if you think real hard now, sucker. You just might remember that I was told I could re-record my Fender for the new record. Uh, Michael Flanagan, this great actor, you, you probably all heard of him and know what, he, what he's been in, uh, was actually in our film. Uh, a little short part, but a very important part, I must say. It's about when, uh, when Steve is to leave uh, the United States to go back to his home, I mean, returning home is much of the, the message in this film and I think that Michael Flanagan, he, he really did, he really lifted uh, Harold, I must say. He, that was the first time when we, we shot this that I really felt that, wow, there is an actor in Harold because Michael really, whew, I mean, just the interaction between them was so great to see. Uh, Funny part is that, that he, he was making uh, this uh, film in London and, and he called us up and say, hey, I heard you're making this great movie and is there a part for me? Wow, Michael Flanagan calling us. I mean, terrific. He was in directly and he flew in and we did a scene two days later and he was brilliant from start to finish. Miss, could you move that blanket, please? This one? Why? Because... Oh, 
all out to yourself now. Question, <laughs> will there be Scorched Heat 2? Actually, um, it's requested from fans all over the world and of course it's when you experience a film like this, it's all, you always hope that there is more, there is more, so you, you long for the, for, for, uh, for the sequel. But uh, actually, I, um, we had uh, a little get-together, me and Harold was there, uh, uh, Babs Brinkland, uh, and even uh, Martin Branquist, who was doing the music and played the part of Eric. Uh, we talked about how fun it should be and how much more there is, but, but after, after, after really talking through, we realized that Scorched Heat uh, is, uh, it ends where it ends. It's, there's really, to tell more, it, it, it doesn't feel right. I mean, it's just like Spielberg, he's been asked to do a second E.T., but he refuses, and so do we. We, we, uh, we set the ending and there it stays. But could they? Eric, she's not here! <laughs> it's not easy to destroy when you don't know what's real. Scorched Heat. From Cobra Productions. It will burn you to the bone.